sweetheart. Oh my God, it is so good to see your face. Oh, you too. Everything good? I'm coming home for a couple weeks. Really? Yeah. Well, that's great news. That means you can be my plus one. Plus what? All right, you remember me talking about Darren Connor, my super rich client, owns like a bazillion different businesses, real estate, hotels, casinos. Yeah, the one who wrote that stupid Get Rich book. Yeah. What was it? Why shouldn't you have it all? <laughs> He's opening a new resort, and guess who's in charge of his super deluxe invite only? Opening bash. Who? You're an ass. Yeah, sometimes. So how about it? Five days of sun, beach. It's just a short trip for you. I was really just looking forward to getting back home. Back to Michigan. I'm sorry, it's my job. Bad timing, I know. Why don't you just come home? No, no way, look. You're my home. It doesn't matter where I am. I love you back. Oh my god. Isn't it beautiful? Still a little far away, huh? A little bit, yeah. efficient resort in this part of the world. As you know, this island rests in close proximity to uh, the volcanic corridor. Oh yeah, everyone knows that. So we've constructed our own geothermal plant, allowing us to use heat for power. Impressive security. Yes, 24-hour armed guards in the security towers, top of the line civic. We're actually having our opening party here tomorrow night. I mean, I know you see exotic spots like this all the time, but this is pretty decent for us civilian folk. Sierra, you copy? Fair enough. Hmm. You know, I haven't seen you like this since... Well, since ever. Last one was bad, huh? Yeah, it's just one of those sideways. Anything you could have done? I don't know, I just got a closer look than I usually get. You wanna talk about it? Just thinking about a change. Wow. Not to put ideas in your head, but you know I'm proud of you. Whether you're saving the world or sweeping the floor. <laughs> you know, I know there was some good reason I married you. You have very low expectations. <laughs> it's so nice to see someone having a good time. I was just waiting for you to arrive. Darren Connor, this is my husband. Joe Linwood. Soldier, right? Actually, he's a Marine. Hmm, right. Can I talk with you? I'm getting 20 phone calls an hour from some Kosang representative. They have a reporter from some local rag up my ass for an interview I do not want to get. And some Greenpeace lawyer trying to hit me with injunctions. So can you just please do your job now, thank you? Absolutely. On my way. Pleasure. You need to replace the champagne. It's just the kitchen I will not give to my dog. And you thought your job was dangerous, huh? I like it, really. Mm -hmm. I'll be back as soon as I can. Guess what's for you. That's what I've been going to do. Okay. Keep doing it.
Hello? Hey. Close. Sorry, um, I'm from the resort. They said you could be booked for a snorkeling tour. We're not exactly up and running yet. Do tell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, please. A favor for your fellow Yankees. Oh, hell. Well, if you're gonna hit me in that soft spot of mine, I guess so. But just so you know, one Yankee to another, I'm gonna overcharge you. Oh, well, thanks for the heads up. Can you talk? Uh, not if you can get away with it. Uh. Trophy husband. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Your choice. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Run? No. Try it. Yeah, Marine. Mm, I thought so. Where are you at? Paris Island or Pendleton? Pendleton. Yeah. Hollywood monkey, huh? Force recon. You? Just a uh, regular SF Ranger. Explosive. Engineer, I blew shit up. Powder monkey, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Once upon a time, yeah? Joe. Joe? Church. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, come on. Let's get you all geared up. Okay? Yeah? Yeah. Does, uh, does this mean you're not going to overcharge me now? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no choice. Sharks love yellow. That's great, baby. <laughs> He's joking. None of this was on any of the maps until your fancy resort showed up. It gets better. The other end of that beach, there's a cave. It leads you right back to your resort. Let's make sure you head west, okay? They teach you that in the Marine Corps, don't they? The difference between east and west? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Go get him, honey. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Thank you. First day you got bored. I know who I married you. And I couldn't be happy. Church was right. <laughs> you want to go back? Go on. I have a party for you tonight. That reporter was right wrong again, only this time he was pestering Mr. Chavalt about his opinion on the Greenpeace legal action against me. Need I remind you that Mr. Chavalt is one of our major shareholders? So that is just not acceptable. My apologies, Mr. Connor. I'll get right on it. Oh, please. Now the damage is done. <laughs> oh, great. G.I. Joe's here. What, you got an opinion? I'm just going to kick my ass. <laughs> no, sir. See, unlike some, I don't pick a woman half my size. Oh. And G.I. is army moron. I'm a Marine. Okay, Joe, it's fine. No, Robin, hey, it's hey, not it's fine. fine. Joe, please. It's fine. Number one, I'm sorry about that. It will not happen again. Number two, 
The reason you're having trouble with the reporter is because you constantly ignore my recommendation, which is given 20 minutes. I'm not going to talk with any reporter. You answer the questions you want, and when he brings up the injunctions, you smile sweetly and say it's all being worked out. It can only help you look better and not like a rich American outsider with something to hide. However, first things first, you have an opening speech to give. Good evening, friends, colleagues, and investors. I would like to introduce you to our host, the chairman of Connor Industries, Mr. Darren Connor. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you honor me by being the first official guest of our magnificent new experience. Welcome to the Tanjala Beach Resort, where you will never have to ask yourself, why shouldn't I have it on? You know, before I created Tanjala, there was nothing here. Well, nothing but a wasted opportunity. This fabulous island was formed by inefficiency, archaic thinking, and a subsequent lack of employment for the local population. But I have changed all that. Water, fire, earth, air. They are... Uh, Emery! Yes! <laughs> Crazy ass powder monkey. <laughs> uh, how many jobs you got, anyway? I've been known to moonlight. <laughs> Gonna have a good show tonight. Hey, look at this. Yeah, kick on this. Pop flare. I threw it up at the end for old time's sake. Ah, military's nightlife. Nobody else gets it, but I don't give a shit. Hmm. What's going on? You and a little woman having a thing? Uh, her boss was being an asshole, and somehow... I'm the bad guy. Uh, well, don't take it personal, all right? You gotta remember, she's on her own most of the time. Can't be waiting around for your sorry ass to show up and be all macho for her, right? <laughs> yeah. Look, brother. I'm not the kind of guy to be giving a lot of advice. If I were you? I'll shop those knee pads, head back up there, and tell her how sorry I was. A couple young things like you, I can guarantee you the makeup sex will be well worth it. <laughs> that how you did it? Nope. <laughs> Look at me now, right? King of the world, ma. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Mm. Come on. Beat it. I'm about to light this place up. Solar energy from the sun. Hydroelectric from the ocean. Geothermal from the earth. And the harnessing of wind. On behalf of Connor Industries, I thank you and wish you a very enjoyable vacation. Here's to it! Yeah, yeah, yeah. These hicks wouldn't know a thermodynamic converter from a hot fart. All they care is it says, please recycle on it. What's next? Mingling with gas.
are you doing here? Hello, Mr. Kano. 